Hi, my name's Ed Gregory for PhotosInColor.com and today I'm going to show you how to retouch eyes in Lightroom really quickly as well. Okay, so we all know that when we take somebody's photograph, the most important thing is eyes. Now, when you're taking the photograph, make sure they are pin sharp. That is the number one important thing when shooting people. Um, so make sure you've done that. Now, once you've done it and you're going to do some editing on the image, you really want to enhance that on the eyes themselves. And there's some really easy techniques to do this. So let's jump into Photoshop and have a look. So today we're going to be working with on um, this photograph just here that I took um, uh, last year, I believe. And we're basically going to be using the brush tool, which is up here. So if we were to take the brush tool or K, okay, hit K and it's going to bring up this. So let's zoom in actually on the eye. Let's just work on this one eye. We can see there's some red just here and the eye is a little bit dull. So we want to just highlight that. So let's bring up this by hitting K and let's make a start. So let's reset all of this. Uh, okay, so these are all of our sliders. Double tapping the word actually allows us to reset it like so. Now, what we're going to want to do is work with the eye. So let's first of all, let's this white section here will get rid of the redness from it really quickly. All we do is we take the saturation, we drop it down quite a lot like so. And then all we're going to do is paint on this section. So let's just paint out this section and we can see very quickly we've gone from an eye that was a little bit red and we're also going to lift the shadows like so and boost it a little bit so it makes it a little bit whiter okay so let's have a quick look at this uh, before and after looks absolutely great it was that quick okay the next thing we're going to do is add a new brush and on this section here we're going to just boost this section in the color and everything so we're going to boost the saturation in this one and again, boost the exposure a little tiny bit uh, and the shadows, we're going to lift the shadows. And so if we literally in one little swipe across here, we're going to go around and that for me already looks great. We come back here, beginning and the end. I think we can actually make that a little bit more saturated. We're actually gonna add some yellow toning to this. It's making it a little bit more yellow. So that's boosting the temperature. And let's lift the shadows a little bit more. That looks really great. Okay, then we're gonna add a new one. And this time we're gonna take the shadows down and the exposure down just a little bit and leave the saturation about where it is. And we're gonna paint in these outside lines and the pupil itself so let's look at before this and after before and after that's starting to look great on that section of the eye and then what we can actually do is add one more and for this one we're going to boost the clarity up quite a lot the sharpness up a little bit reset the the clarity and boost brightness and shadows a little tiny bit. This is for the entire eye. And this is basically just makes it shine. So if we just paste over the whole eye now, we can see that just kind of boosted the entire thing. I'm actually gonna take my contrast down because I think it went too far. And boost those shadows up that little bit more. And that for me is really looking amazing. So if we look at the beginning, this is how the eye started. This is how the eye ended, looking great. Let's zoom out. Okay, and close that down. This is how the eye is looking at the end. This is how it looked to begin with. I mean, the, the change is dramatic. I think I've actually gone a little bit too far. That's what's amazing about this. You can click on this and we could go into any of these here. We can see that's the whites of the eyes. This is the overall. So I'm actually gonna bring back that clarity down a little bit and the shadows back because I think I went a little bit too far with that one. That's now looking a lot better for me and looking great. If we did that to both eyes, 
that I would just be popping now. Okay, importantly is don't go too far with the eyes. I think I went a little bit far there. Don't push your eyes too far, they look unnatural. I just wanted to show you really what the different brushes are and things that you can do to, to edit your eyes. Um, if you like the video, please give me a thumbs up and remember to subscribe, loads more videos on the way. And my name was Ed Gregory for photosincolor.com.